hello everyone how to solve this problem for the values of x if we have x cubed minus x squared is equals to 48 and we solve this problem for the values of x so here we find all the roots of this equation so i hope so you like this method but if you have any other method in your mind so please don't hesitate to write this method into the comment section now here first we need to focus into the right hand side and here we have this is x cubed minus x square and now we break this right hand side 48 as 64 minus 16 we write 48 as 64 minus 16 uh, so it will be written as 48 and, and now further in the next step we have this is x cubed minus x square is equal to uh, here we write uh, this 64 as 4 cubed minus we write this 16 as 4 square and further in the next step we move the terms from right hand side to the left hand side and we make the pair of cubic term and square term as well so here we make that um, uh, pair of x cubed this 4 cubed and when we move 4 cubed into the left hand side it will become minus 4 cubed and here we move this minus 4 square into the left hand side uh, and it will become plus 4 square and this whole equation is equals to 0. And now further in the next step we uh, need a little bit simplification here it will become x cubed minus 4 cubed and here we take common minus sign it will be written as x square minus 4 square and this is equal to 0 and now here we need a two nice algebraic formula you know about that if we have a cubed uh, minus b cubed it is equals to a minus b times of a square plus a b plus b square so here first we apply this cubic formula uh, on first term and uh, here we apply this square formula a square minus b square is equals to a minus b times of a plus b so here we need uh, these two formulas so now first we apply here uh, the cubic formula so according to cubic formula this term is written as in this form first we have a minus b over a is x and b is 4 into a square so a is x square plus a b a is x and b is 4 plus b square b is 4 square minus this is x square minus 4 square we use this nice formula so according to this uh, above x equation is written as x minus 4 times of x plus 4 is equals to 0 and now here uh, you focus on both of these terms and you see here both of these terms involve x minus 4 uh, so we will take common x minus 4 here and we get the remaining values are from here we get x square plus 4x plus this 4 square equals to 16 minus when we take common x minus 4 from here we get minus times of x plus 4 so we multiply this negative sign on both of these values it will be written as minus x minus 4 is equals to 0 and now further in the next step we need more simplifications and it will be written as x minus 4 times of x square this 4x minus x becomes here 3x and plus this is 16 minus 4 is equals to 12 and this whole equation is equal to 0 and now further in the next step we divide this equation into the two cases the first case is we write x minus 4 is equals to 0 and the second case is we write x square plus 3x plus 12 is equals to 0 and now from here we easily get the value of x is equals to 4 so this is the first real root of the given equation and now here in order to find the other roots we need to solve this quadratic equation and here we solve this quadratic equation by applying the quadratic formula uh, so that 
in order to uh, solve this we apply the quadratic formula and now we write the coefficients of this equation and its coefficients are a is equals to 1 b equals to 3 and c equals to 12 and we state the quadratic formula as x equals minus b plus minus square root of b square minus 4 times of ac divided by 2 times of a this is the our uh, quadratic formula and now here we substitute the above values of a b and c here after substituting these values uh, it will be written as x is equals to this is minus b the value of b is 3 plus minus square root of b square so b is 3 square minus 4 times of a is 1 c is 12 and it is divided by 2 times of a and here our a is equals to 1 and now further in the next step we have this is x is equals to minus 3 plus minus square root of this is 3 square and we know that 3 square is equals to 9 minus 4 times of 12 is equals to 48 and it is divided by 2 and now here in the next step we need more simplifications and it will be written as x is equals to this is minus 3 plus minus square root of 9 minus 48 is equals to minus 39 and it is divided by 2 and now here uh, we need a little bit simplification here and it will be written as x is equals to minus 3 plus minus here we break square root sign and we apply square root on minus 1 and square root on 39 and it is divided by 2 and now here uh, our final step is that we get minus 3 plus minus we know that square root of minus 1 is equals to iota and it will be written as square root of 39 into iota and it is divided by 2 so these are the other two complex roots of the given equation and we have x is equals to 4 be the one real root of the given equation. So these are the three roots of the given equation and this is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos.